They are long lasting. They are liners. They are nude. Nabla just released new shades of their lip shapers, but this time in more rosy tones. If you're looking for lip swatches and swatches and my humble opinion about this product, you can count on me. Hello and welcome! My name is Eva and this is the topic of today's video. So Nabla close-up lip shapers, so lip liners. This is not the newest product when we are talking about Nabla, but they are for sure new shades. First, like original shades are just nude shades. So these shades from number one to number six. By the way, if you're looking for swatches, lip swatches of the, the first just uh, shades of these lip liners, then of course I have a video uh, that unfortunately is a little bit old because I recorded like two years ago, but still these are these pencils. I'm sorry, I'm not going to swatch 12 shades today on my lips, especially that this product is really long lasting, which means it's a little bit dry. Like it doesn't make your lips dry, but it's very hard to remove it from your lips. So I just want to say that today's lip swatching will hurt <laughs> my lips, of course. Here we are with the new shades of these lip liners. And here we have not brown nude tones, but rosy tones. I think that still, indeed, it's a nude scale. However, more in rosy tones from 1.5 through to that 5 and so on and so on, ending with 6.5. I don't know if I can say anything more than, of course, start swatching uh, these lip liners, starting from the lightest one to the darkest one, and I hope that you will enjoy.
can I tell you about the newest shades of uh, Nabla close-up lip shapers, so Nabla lip liners. For sure this is the same formula because my lips actually hurt right now. It's not that this product is super drying, but uh, these are lip liners and I just applied six of them on my lips and actually I also applied other lipsticks before them because this makeup uh, will be as my uh, one of my next tutorial because this is makeup that will match to any kind of lipstick and any color. Uh, so to prove it <laughs> I applied a lot of lip product before I started to applying these and they are enough lip devastating. Of course not by their own but when you're going to apply six of them then probably you will feel it. <laughs> These are lip liners, so uh, you use them to outline your lips, uh, to keep your uh, lipstick on place. But of course you can use them also just as lip product and apply them all over your lips. They are very, very nice for it and I can tell you because I have previous six shades and uh, yeah, I love them very, very much. I use them a lot as lip liners, but I also use them a lot as uh, just lip product. However, I would say that they are not extremely comfortable. They are more like matte lipstick. So I rather to use them as lip liners, although the colors of these lip liners are amazing. And you can actually use them as lip products with, for example, a clear lip gloss or lip balm. Then you're going to dissolve a little bit of this formula, keep the uh, color, but in the same time remove this drying effect. So this is little and quick review because let's be honest, swatches and lip swatches were much more important. So right now we have 12 shades in a lip shapers collection, nudes in beigey brownish shades and nudes in more rosy and ready shades. Once again, slight reminder that this makeup, I mean face and eyes, is makeup that will match to any kind of lip product you want to use, especially any color you want to use. And this makeup tutorial will appear in the future on my channel. So if you're interested, I don't know, subscribe or hit notification bell to get notification to don't miss this video or just visit me again sometime. <laughs> so that will be it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And as always, I love you very, very much and I see you very, very soon. Bye!